welcome to a new video on tech tips from CMM XYZ. In this video, let's explore the advancement of the clearance queue functionality and the introduction of a new command called moveset in PCDMS 2023.1. If you're new to the clearance queue feature in PCDMS, a helpful resource to begin with is the tech tips video titled The Clearance Cube by CMM XYZ. You can find the link to the video in the description. PCDMS 2023.1 introduces a new settings window for the clearance queue feature. You can easily show or hide this window by using the icon located in the toolbar specifically designed for the clearance cube. This clearance cube settings window enables the user to quickly turn on or off the clearance cube directly in the window displayed below graphic display window. The clearance cube functionality controlling the movement of the probe was earlier placed in the clearance cube definition dialog under the status tab. Now, in the latest version of PCDMS 2023.1, the status tab has been removed from the clearance cube definition dialog and is displayed in a separate window. Next, we can see the status of the clearance cube for a feature by clicking and bringing the cursor on the feature. We can disable the clearance cube for multiple features by highlighting the features in edit window. Highlight the features in edit window and in clearance cube settings window, we can disable or enable the clearance cube for those features based on the requirements. Here, we don't require clearance cube movement from circle 3 to circle 8. Highlight the features in edit window and disable the clearance cube on all the features at a time from the clearance cube settings window by turning off activate clearance cube moves. We can also change the clearance cube settings for individual features before and after feature measurement using starting phase and ending phase. Now when we check the path lines for the features you'll see that the clearance cube has been disabled for features from circle 3 to circle 8. Next, let's see how move sets work. Here, I have a point that's taken inside a notch. The path of the probe shows that the probe is traveling in clearance cube before entering the notch. We can optimize this movement by adding move points before the probe reaches the clearance cube to measure the feature. To add move sets, place the cursor before the feature and navigate to Insert, Move, Move Sets. Using this dialog box, we can add move points in Move Set. We can add a move point from Add Move Point icon, which is the plus icon, or Read from Machine Position icon. Let's add a move point from Add Move Point icon. Using this icon, you can add move points directly from the move point button in your jog box. Here, I'll add a move point at two positions to optimize the path of the probe by manipulating X, Y and Z coordinate. You can see two points are displayed in the graphic display window showing the path of move set. Two move points are added in the list. Then press OK to add the move set command in the edit window. As you can see, a move set is a collection of move points. Now, if we check the path lines, the probe moves to the move point given in the move set before going to the clearance queue set for the feature, which can be edited later based on the requirements. This is a video on clearance cube settings and move sets in PCDMS 2023.1. Thank you for watching the video.